beautiful Pisces how are you today today we're doing your reading for the next 7 to 14 days let's see what comes up for Pisces uh, we're in a make make do uh, reading space right now I'm away from home away from the studio so whatever comes up today um, just know that if it doesn't resonate you release it back to the universe okay what have we got for Pisces please what energy time to calibrate so here it's time to work with others, time for you to allow others into your space to help you. Working together brings everything together. You know that saying, together everything is better? Well, that's what they're saying here, time for deep dive. So here what they're saying is, Pisces, it's for time for you to calibrate with others in anything that you want to achieve and to... Sometimes we need to do things on our own, but sometimes we need help. And here it's a time for you to get help from others. There may be something you're trying to achieve, or there may be something here that you can't do on your own. So you're going to need calibration from other people um, to help you get there. The other thing is that you need to dig deep and find out what it is that you truly want. What is it that excites you? What is it that you want for your life? And they're asking you to really look deep within and, and see what you can do or how that can work for you. Let's see what else we have for Pisces, please. Pisces, thank you. The Knight of Wands. Where are you going to, Pisces? There's a new beginning here. And it fell under Calibrate. So someone's going to help you create a new beginning. We've got the sun. Look at that, Pisces. The sun. So you're moving in a new direction. And that direction is going to bring you clarity. It's going to bring you what you need. It's going to bring you what you want. What else have we got? The Ten of Cups. Family celebration. Family getting together. It's not only whatever you're trying to achieve is going to be just for you, but it's also going to bring a lot of prosperity and happiness for the family. So I don't know what you're doing here, but it's like you're heading in a new direction. You're going to a new place, a new job, something new that brings you um, prosperity. It brings you clarity. It brings you meaning, that, that feeling of excitement again. And you're going to celebrate that with the most important people in your life the death card and that's transformation so that's not a bad card Pisces that's just saying it's time to transform what is it that you want to achieve where do you want to go this is a new beginning where everything that doesn't belong moves away from you now you're going to have clarity of what's important to you look at that the star beautiful it's like the higher divine is helping you reach where you need to reach. It's helping you connect with the right people. It's helping you see things in a different way. It's helping you really delve deep inside yourself, into your soul, so that you can see what you want to do and how that's going to impact you. And on the bottom, we've got nothing. So there's no news there on the bottom. Let's see what else we have. Let's use... Let's use this card here. We'll use this deck and see what else comes up for Pisces. So Pisces, someone here is about to take off in a new direction, about to start something new. And I feel that it's in calibration with somebody else. Someone else is going to help you with this process. Look at that. The Knight of Swords. A time for decision making, a time to stand up, a time to create your own, a time to be true to yourself, a time where now you uh, stand very firm on what you believe in and what you want. And this is you turning your imagination into reality. The Knight of Swords is very true, very, very rational, very true. It's like you're going to take on a responsible you're going in a, a direction that's going to require you to be very responsible, very connected, very true to who you are. Look at that, Pisces, the sun in a different deck above one another. So you've got the sun here and you've got the sun again. Whatever this is that you're going in, whatever direction you're going in, whatever decision you're making, it is meant to be. It's destined to you. So know that things don't happen by mistake. You didn't reach a place or go somewhere because it, it was just a good to, to be. It was, this is meant for you. Things become clear. Things become real. 
here we've got the five of pentacles some of you here are feeling really uh financially tight it's like you're feeling abandoned as much as you you're going to celebrate with the family there were lots of times here where you felt alone you felt like you were doing this on your own you felt that nobody else cared that no one could help you in any way shape or form and here this is a person that carries a lot of a lot of pain or a lot of solitude that you went through so that is going to end look at that the ten of swords that's the end it's the end of the suffering. It's the end of the, the torment. It's the end of that heaviness. This, the death card there and the Ten of Swords above it, means that the end has come. This is time for transformation. This is time for you to leave behind things that were not good for your soul and your spirit, things that weighed you down, people that weighed you down, situations that weighed you down. You are now turning that chapter over. You are now closing that chapter of torment and pain and suffering to now start your new beginning. Wherever you're going, the new direction you're headed to is going to be the direction that's meant for you. What else have we got here for Pisces, please? Pisces. Thank you. Last one. Let's see. Look at that. The devil. The devil with the star. Everything becomes clear now of what you are hanging on to. Sometimes we are obsessed with things. Sometimes we um, let go of who we truly are and we let things overtake us. And here the star is saying everything's going to become clear now everything's going to become clear that where you were you were not meant to be it was all an obsession it was all something that was taking you to a very dark place now with the star things become clear things become real things become more in in, in line with where you want to go and on the bottom the four of cups at some of you had given up some of you had given up on waiting for something new to happen but there it is look at that that one opportunity is going to change your life that one gift that one opportunity that one possibility is going to change your life the three disappointments here three years of hardship three months of hardship three it's, it's three in something about three so in the last three years or the last three months you went through a lot of pain and a lot of sorrow and here this opportunity here takes you away from all of that it's now time for you to let go of what no longer suits you okay let's get one more card here for pisces to close off this reading and see how you're going. Pisces, we're doing some readings via audio. If you're interested in that, the details are below. Um, and that is a full reading based on your information for you only. So it's not a thing. A year from now, a year from now, you're going to be in a totally different place to where you are now. In a year from now, you're, going, you're not going to know yourself. You're going to think, wow, what a path, what a journey. But in a year from now, you're going to be in such a better place. Look at that. The situation will improve. That's not a mistake. That's not a mistake. We spoke about all of this. It's like you're leaving a place of torment and, and torture to some. To some, it may have seemed like it was torturous, but you're leaving that now. And in a year from now, you're not going to know yourself. You're ready. Look at that. For some of you that are worried about making this move, don't be. You are ready. You're ready to take on this new challenge. You're ready to put yourself out there. You're ready to own this. So go with love and light, Pisces. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.